the rebel forces continue to advance and destroy Russian positions in Belgorod region. Russia continues to clash with rebels in Belgorod region. The head of the Belgorod region stated that the Russians have lost control in residential areas. Russia cannot respond to the attacks carried out by the rebel forces. The rebel forces which control the settlements are repelling Russia from the region. Russia is in danger of losing the Belgorod region completely, while the intense attacks of the rebels continue. The rebel forces, who destroyed four armored vehicles and tanks in the region, continue to stand against Russia. While Russia is fighting with the rebels in this region, bad news is coming to Russia from other fronts. The Ukrainian army continues to advance in the Bakhmut region. The Ukrainian army continues to fight for this region. Ukraine's deputy defense minister reported that Ukraine carried out successful operations in and around the northern flank of Bakhmut. The successful and clever operations carried out by the Ukrainian army in the Bakhmut region leave Russia in a desperate situation. Wagner leader Prigozhin stated that Ukraine was allowed to enter Berkivka. Prigozhin, who disagreed with the Russian army and the Russian government, criticized the Russian army which he thought that implementing the wrong strategy. Wagner leader Prigozhin has been having problems with the Russian government and the regular Russian army since the day the war started. Ammunition problems, problems in the chain of command, and lack of coordination between Wagner troops and the Russian army are just a few of these problems. The major problems experienced by the Russian army in the Belgorod region also affect the Russian soldiers fighting on the other front lines. Resources transferred to different fronts weaken the strength of the Russian army. It is very difficult to fight on too many fronts at the same time and to focus on this war. Russia's inability to solve the problem is the Belgorod region puts Russia far behind in the war. This situation is very positive and for Ukraine and for negative for Russia. Do you think the Ukrainian army will be able to take advantage of the situation of Russia? Do you think Russia will be able to control the Belgorod region? You can share your thoughts with us by commenting. To reach all actual news fast and reliable worldwide, please don't forget to follow and like us.